Welcome to Tasting with Thompson. What we're going to be doing is tasting random foods or uh, drinks, beers, whatever we find, uh, and just kind of giving our thoughts on how it tastes and how we feel about it. Because we like to drink. And eat. And eat. I'm Eric. I'm Jessica. And we are starting off this week with uh, an almond milk stout. And it's vegan. So this is a vegan stout brewed with almond milk from East Lake Craft Brewery. Uh, we are in Minnesota near the Twin Cities. So this is a local uh, brewery for us. Um, I'm not sure if they... Uh, if they ship or anything like that, but... Um, it's a very large can. It is a very large can. very, like... So, generous portions. Generous portion size. I mean, we have our glasses filled to the brim. There is still lots more left in here. It smells. smells it's got, it's, it has a nice... Like, it's real subtle. It doesn't smell like... It's not a stinky a beer. It's not definitely um, not a stinky beer. And it doesn't smell like it has... A lot of hops that it's very like heavy handed. Cheers. It's not bad. I mean, it doesn't, it's not like the full bodied experience that I usually go for in a beer like this. Mm -hmm. I usually like these beers to be kind of, kind of thick and, you know, kind of knock kind you on of your weigh ass. It down. Um, well. <laughs> I could, I could see that. Uh, this, it's, it's a, especially for a can this size. I think, I think it's a good heaviness for a can this size. <laughs> Probably. Um, like because if you're going to drink was... the whole thing, how, how much is in here? This looks like this could be a liter. Oh, it's, it's a pint. Okay, it's a pint. If I was going for a pint, uh, that, that looks so big compared <laughs> to what I would think for a pint. <laughs> if I was going for a pint of beer... This is one that I could drink and then probably have a second without too much trouble. It, it doesn't feel heavy. It's so much lighter than like a Guinness or, you know, anything. Any other stouts that I've had. It's very drinkable. I could drink this in the summer without wanting to die. Um, <laughs> and uh, I know you don't do uh, regular milk anymore. Yes, I am lactose intolerant, which is very sad, very tragic. Um, so this is why this was actually gifted to us. Mm -hmm. So you thought of me. Thank Almond you. milk. Thank you, James. James thank you, Bryn. and Bryn. Yeah, I do. The, I do like it. But usually I'm going through something a little thicker, a little, a little bit more body. That's fair. But then again, I, I love earthy beers. I would plant my face in dirt and eat dirt because that's how much <laughs> I, I yeah, I love hops. Uh, I love bitterness. <laughs> uh, let's use our yum box scale. Uh, All right, we're, do, we're doing the yum box scale. Um, so total of five, with one decimal point. Mm. I think it's really drinkable. I enjoy it. I'd give it a solid. I think I would go with maybe a three point eight. I uh, yeah, I'm, I'm about in there. Maybe a three point five. You know, just because I'm looking for just a little bit more, more depth, more flavor. I mean, it, though, once I'm, like, down to here in the can, I think that rating may go up. <laughs> <laughs> That's when we're not sharing, right? That's when we're not sharing. So. Though, this is a nice size. It's very shareable. Mm -hmm. So if you have lots of friends, although we're recording this, we're in quarantine, so you're probably not going to have a lot of people sharing your beer with you. So, but after. So more beer for you. So more beer for you. All right. 3.8, 3.5. 3.5. East Lake uh, Vegan Almond Milk Stout. Cheers. Cheers. Everybody.